the themes of the piece that are important to me are the questions about guilt and innocence. Um, it's a story where a young girl accuses someone actually with whom she has a very close and healthy relationship of being a witch. Um, I won't give away why, because you have to come and see the performance to discover that. But by the end of the story, you really don't know who was the guilty party. Was it the witch? Well, no, it's not, because actually this particular woman was exonerated by the Swiss government in 2008, so she's been made innocent. Does that make the young girl who accused her guilty? Maybe, to some extent, but she was only eight years old when she accused Anna Goldie. So who is guilty? Was it her mother, her father? For various different reasons, you could call any of them guilty or innocent, and that's really exciting to me. The other thing that's important is memory. And in this piece, um, the actress plays the young girl grown up and dead for 200 years, so she's a ghost. And this ghost is uh, unsettled in her death and she goes back in her memory three times. And I guess that, I think Freud talks about excavating memories, I think that idea of digging deeper into what you think you remember until you discover truths that you've blocked is really interesting. And perhaps that's something that we all experience in some way, we, we put some memories into compartments that we never open up again and I find that really fascinating. Um, if you should, uh, how would you describe the performance in three words, just using three words? The performance in three words is really hard to do. It's very emotional and moving. I'm calling that one word. It's thought-provoking, that would be my second word. And it's cathartic, I think, in the end. There's a sense of release and, um, yeah, tension being released, so cathartic would be my third word. Mm -hmm. If uh, this Polish uh, version will, will be different than the one that you've made in the past? It's the, actually, Polish will be the third language in which the performance is um, staged. It was first performed, well, it was written in English by Edward Kemp, who's an English playwright and dramaturg and director. It was then translated into German and actually premiered in German in Bern and performed in, at the Royal Opera House in London in English. And now it's been translated from the English into Polish. Um, other than that, it shouldn't be very different. Obviously, when we're restaging the work for the dancers here, there might be tweaks to the choreography according to the specific dancers and what works for them. Um, but essentially, it will be the same.